You know, one of the criticisms about ADD is we're all forgetful. Um, we're all disorganized at times or we miss appointments. Of course, that's true. Um, the difference, of course, between that and having a psychiatric disorder is how severe is it and what problems does it cause us in life. Now, problems are what we call impairment. In other words, what difficulties do these various symptoms lead to? If I can give you a, a, an easy example, somebody might say, don't sleep very well. That's a symptom. My next question would be, well, what difficulties does that cause you? You might say, none. So you can't have a psychiatric disorder. You've got a symptom, but you've got no impairment, and there's no need to treat you. With ADD, if somebody has problems in one area of their life only, so they come along and they say, Tony, everything is fine. My marriage is on the rocks. Tongue in cheek, I'm going to say, get a new wife. It's environmental. Get a new wife, get a new job. Wherever the problem is, that's what you need to focus on. With people that have an attentional problem, usually their difficulties are across every area of their life. Makes sense, doesn't it? Um, we have to check that it's at least two areas. If it's at least two areas, you can't blame one environmental factor, and it is likely, or at least possible, that an attentional disorder is to blame.